Hello, I'm Raida Boost, and in this video I will do a first run of Autogad 2017 and I hope that you have successfully installed your product and if you have watched my previous video then you should be able to see an icon on your Windows desktop that enables to fire up your Autogad 2017. But I would also like to make a quick note that um, with Autogad 2017 you also installed Autodesk Recap 360 that helps to manipulate your point cloud data before you actually use that information in your AutoCAD 2017 workflows. And also you have A360 desktop app and also Autodesk desktop app. A360 enables to collaborate with your friends, co-workers through Autodesk cloud services and it also helps to back up your design data. And using this desktop app, you can easily find your files from anywhere. I have also made a short video about Autodesk desktop app. That is your main app when you want to see if some updates are available to your product or products. But right now I continue with double clicking on AutoCAD 2017 to fire up my AutoCAD first time. If I have also previous versions installed, then I get this small dialog that enables me to migrate my custom settings from previous version. I can do it later on also, so I don't have to do it right now. So as you see, I can do it from Windows Start menu later on. So that is why I just cancel it right now. Now my AutoCAD 2017 loads first time. And of course, if it's my first run, then uh, I need to make a selection what kind of license I want to use. That's a new big thing with Autodesk 2017 product line. So you actually, during your installation, you didn't select any license beforehand. You can do and you can switch during fire up your Autodesk product and you can also change the license quite easily during your work days. So if you pick for example a single license or subscription license then maybe next time you start your AutoCAD only a network license is available and you can switch from one to another quite easily. In previous versions you actually needed to reinstall the software and pick a license type. At the moment I start my trial license so I click on start the trial. My AutoCAD 2017 is successfully loaded and as I use my trial license I can see a notification about how many days uh, left. I can click on that to cancel it. And if you have used AutoCAD before, then probably you don't notify any big changes in here. But if you are a new user, then perhaps the first thing to do is to click on learn button down below here or left hand side. This is a central part from where you find different videos how to start to work with your AutoCAD 2017. But if you are a current user, then we will talk about new features in my later videos. I will close this video by showing you how to dismiss my license type so that I can actually start again when firing up my AutoCAD. I will then see again a dialog that enables me to select what kind of license I want to use. But of course, if I have already started my trial license, those days are counting. So just next to question mark, I can pick about Autodesk AutoCAD 2017. I can then click manage license and now I can see a activate button here and it will notify me that if I start an activation process I actually can save my drawings I don't have any drawing open but I can also quit without saving it means that my AutoCAD will be closed and next time I start my AutoCAD I can select what kind of license I want to use so in that way I can easily switch in between different license types really easy 